Welcome back everyone, because today I'm genuinely excited to share a tool that has been absolutely saving me hours in my editing process. If you've ever stared at a full-length talking head video feeling completely overwhelmed about turning it into snackable clips, then you absolutely need to stick around for this. I'm about to walk you through this specific editor, detailing how it functions, what its absolute best features are, and why it might actually outperform other AI editors getting a lot of hype right now. I took one of my own five-minute videos as a test subject, and the resulting clips were honestly so much better than what I had originally anticipated. Getting set up with this platform is, quite frankly, ridiculously simple from the very first step. You won't encounter any weird onboarding steps or overly complicated settings that block you before you can even upload your first file. The process is basically just signing up, dropping in your main video file, and then the artificial intelligence immediately starts analyzing everything. The entire philosophy behind this tool is heavily optimized specifically for talking head content creators like us. So if you film yourself teaching, reviewing, or just riffing on a topic, this was clearly designed with your workflow in mind. It even proactively offers helpful hints about which specific formats and styles tend to perform best across different social media platforms. This feature is super handy when you're trying to juggle posting to TikTok, YouTube Shorts, and Instagram Reels simultaneously. Now, after you finally upload your source clip, the tool doesn't just mindlessly spit out random cuts for you to sift through. Instead, it intelligently scans the entire video specifically looking for those high engagement moments across the board. This means it targets the parts with the strongest hooks, the biggest emotional peaks, or the most concise takeaway messages for the audience. It then automatically generates a whole batch of shorts that are already ready to post immediately onto your channels. For the single five-minute video I tested, this system suggested a surprisingly large number of genuinely shareable clips, definitely more than I would have manually found myself. The editing decisions it makes feel very intentional, featuring nice tight cuts and sensible starting points for each segment. Furthermore, the captions it generates actually match the natural cadence of my speech instead of awkwardly chopping sentences in half. One of the features I genuinely love about this system is the sheer amount of customization it hands back to the user. The platform provides a selection of pre-designed template styles you can immediately apply to your output. You also get fine-grained control over the caption appearance and the ability to set specific clip length targets. Do you specifically need snappy 15-second clips for your TikTok feed, but longer 30 to 45-second segments for YouTube shorts? That is incredibly easy to set up as a preference for the AI. Once you set those parameters, the artificial intelligence will consistently respect them across all generated content. You always retain this power to manually refine any caption, quickly add relevant emojis, or even swap out the automatically selected thumbnail frame. It truly avoids that restrictive one-size-fits-all trap because you can always steer the final aesthetic to perfectly match your established channel personality. I'm aware there are definitely other pieces of software out there that promise very similar repurposing features to this one. Some of those competitors look great initially, but they often harbor real downsides once you dig deeper into their limitations. A lot of those alternative tools demand hefty monthly subscription fees for what ultimately amounts to pretty basic clipping functionality. Other tools really only focus on simple trimming and offer zero help with actual posting strategy or planning. A common issue I've noticed is that some competitors are strangely robotic about their cut points, often starting your clip right in the middle of a sentence which makes the segment feel jarring. This particular tool effectively handles all those major pain points in a way that actually makes content repurposing manageable for solo creators. Stepping beyond simple clipping, this editor has a couple of built-in features that made it instantly stand out in my personal testing process. A key one is the dedicated auto-editing viral clips function, where the AI not only selects moments with high performance potential, but also edits them into ready-to-publish formats. This feature automatically includes captions and suggests the correct aspect ratios for immediate posting. That singular function alone saves an immense amount of time because you don't have to jump between multiple different apps just to add text overlays or resize for vertical viewing. Another massive time saver that truly changed my workflow is the simple but powerful auto-schedule option. You can set exactly how frequently you desire to post new content to your various channels. Then the system automatically queues up those freshly edited clips and publishes them according to your predetermined schedule without any intervention. For anyone who absolutely hates the manual process of uploading, or for creators who need a very consistent posting cadence without constantly babysitting every single drop, this is a legitimate game-changer for efficiency. I managed to set my preferred cadence once and then simply let the platform populate all my social feeds automatically. Suddenly, all that tedious workflow friction associated with daily posting practically vanished from my routine. Furthermore, the integrated content calendar feature organizes everything beautifully for long-term planning. Instead of constantly juggling dozens of separate exported files and trying to remember which clip goes out on which day, this gives you one centralized calendar view. 
From this single panel, you can easily preview clips, quickly reorder them, make final caption tweaks, and even select the specific publishing platform for each one. It seems like a small detail, but having that singular control panel means you can plan an entire week's worth of content in just one focused sitting. I also want to point out one of the more nerdy parts of the system that I personally got a lot of enjoyment out of exploring. Every single clip that the AI generates comes bundled with useful metadata attached to it. This metadata includes a brief summary, a full transcript, and even a potential performance score calculated by the system. Visit rates each clip based on key factors like the strength of the opening hook, the overall engagement potential, and its relevance to current trends. It certainly doesn't make the final posting decisions for you, but that scoring system acts as a fantastic guide for prioritizing which clips should go out first. If your time is limited like mine is, being instantly shown the highest probability winners is incredibly helpful for maximizing impact. Of course, no tool is ever going to be absolutely 100% perfect right out of the box, and I'm not expecting it to be. Sometimes the AI's initial caption placement might need just a quick visual adjustment, or I might want to subtly nudge the crop just slightly to better showcase my hand gestures. However, the platform makes performing those tiny necessary edits remarkably fast and extremely easy for the user. You can instantly change the timing of a specific caption segment, swap out any emojis, quickly adjust the overall color styling, or pick a completely different thumbnail frame in just a matter of seconds. That critical level of manual control is essential because it keeps the overall process blazing fast without ever locking you into whatever slightly imperfect version the AI initially outputs. To really give you a concrete idea of what I mean by quality output, let's look back at that original five-minute video I used for testing purposes. Vizard successfully generated a really solid lineup of short clips that naturally felt like entirely separate, coherent pieces of content. This lineup included a very quick hook that immediately explained the main concept of the video, a compelling 20-second demo highlight, a funny or engaging anecdote that was cleanly cut out, and a neat summary clip placed at the very end. Each one of those generated segments felt completely coherent and perfectly shareable on its own merit, which is exactly the goal when you are trying to build a consistent and engaging short-form presence online. When directly comparing this to some of the other popular competitors on the market, this editor manages to hit that perfect sweet spot between full automation and necessary editorial control. Tools that lean too heavily into full automation often leave you with absolutely zero control over the important nuances, and the resulting clips can end up looking painfully generic across the board. On the complete opposite end, using traditional manual editing software requires an absolutely massive investment of your personal time for every single asset. This tool successfully blends high speed with a polished final look, giving you AI-powered selections combined with intuitive manual refinement options. When you start analyzing the pricing structure, this option is generally much more creator-friendly compared to some enterprise-focused editors that charge a huge premium for features that most content creators will never actually utilize. If you happen to be worried about data privacy or how your media files are being used, the workflow here is thankfully straightforward and fully transparent about handling your uploaded content. That transparency really helps provide a sense of reassurance as you integrate a new tool into your pipeline. Furthermore, if you are currently thinking about testing this platform out, the free trial period they offer is actually generous enough for you to see tangible value right away. You can upload a couple of your longer videos, let the system generate a batch of clips, and even test out the scheduling features without feeling any immediate pressure to commit to a paid subscription. So to directly answer the question, is this tool absolutely perfect for every single content creator out there? Realistically, no. If your specific needs involve creating hyper-specific custom animations or complex visual effects shots, you will still absolutely want to rely on a full-fledged professional desktop editor. But for the vast majority of creators whose main goal is to efficiently repurpose their long-form material into a consistent, high-volume stream of short-form content, this is honestly one of the smartest tools I have personally used this year. It cleverly forces you to concentrate on distribution strategy and posting cadence instead of allowing you to get hopelessly stuck down an endless editing rabbit hole. If your current challenge is figuring out how to scale up your content output without massively scaling the amount of time you spend editing every week, then this platform is absolutely worth taking a serious look at today. The user interface is incredibly clean, the auto-editing capabilities are genuinely impressive, scheduling works seamlessly in the background, and the content calendar means you can manage everything from one simple spot. I strongly recommend you take advantage of the free trial and see for yourself just how many usable clips you can extract from one of your existing long videos. The final count might genuinely surprise you. All right, that officially concludes my initial walkthrough of this fantastic editing tool for the moment. If you would like me to create a follow-up video showing a true step-by-step -step process of me uploading that same five-minute video and walking through the exact edits the AI suggested, just let me know in the comments below. Thank you so much for watching this breakdown and I will certainly catch you all in the next video. Happy clipping and good luck with all of your content repurposing efforts.